Two weeks ago, I worked on making over my daughter's bedroom. This dresser was part of the before. I will be keeping it for her, but decided I wanted to give it a refresh since it was just a bit too bland compared to the rest of her room now. So sit back and enjoy as I take you through this quick furniture refresh. I started by removing all of the hardware. Aside from the hinges, I will not be reusing the hardware. I wanted to bring back some of the natural wood tones since the drawers were made of solid wood. I used a 15 minute stripper and applied a generous thick coat using a chip brush. Fifteen minutes later, I scraped off all of the paint using a metal putting knife. I repeated the process of adding another layer of stripper and then began cleaning the base of the dresser using some TSP in warm water. I made sure to rinse it off with plain, clean water to remove any leftover residue. Once all of the scraping was done, I moved on to removing any leftover residue or tackiness by scrubbing it with some mineral spirits soaked fine steel wool, then wiping it clean with a rag. The top of the dresser had some water ring damages so I sanded those smooth. Since the existing paint job was well adhered and I am using a one step paint, I did not scuff sand. I rolled on a total of three coats. I began sanding the drawer fronts with 120 grit followed by 220. At this point, I cleaned the drawers with an all-purpose cleaner. And to finish off the drawer fronts, I rubbed in some oldies oil with some fine steel wool and wiped them down and buffed them with a lint-free rag after about 30 minutes. The last thing left to do was to add new hardware that I cleaned up from my stash. Now let's remember what this dresser used to look like and what it looks like now. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out my full furniture flipping playlist for more. 
Subscribe so you won't miss out on how I will use this dresser in a closet makeover soon. I love y'all. Be kind. I'll see y'all next week. Bye.